That's not bad, is it? The mini bar down here. It's just got bottles of wine and beer in it. Table, the chair, sofa, bed over there, the single bed there. That's not bad. There's more freaking boats in there, it's bloody water. Check it out. We've got a thing lately in Thailand about raising up the, the pavement like a metre high. Salad with like a chicken, cranberry, and there's like a mixture of different stuff. Some raisins, obviously, a picky too. And that's her next to him. Half of his body here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Look <laughs> at that. How cool is that? We're a bit scared, don't come on the top floor. <laughs> yeah, check it out guys, in this video we're heading off to Apatia. Just uh, booked a car to take us down there, but this app called uh, InDriver. It's pretty freaking cool, but it can be a little bit hit, hit and miss. Anyway, uh, yeah, enough waffle. It's a bit late now, we're in a bit of a rush, so we'll catch up with you uh, when we get there. See you in a bit. This is the one, yeah. So here we are. Here we go. Yeah, check it out guys, we've just got to Patia now. Luckily the weather's not too bad, we just had a massive downpour on the, the journey on the trip coming here. And we just got to the hotel now, just about to check in. It's a bit near like soy boy, boy cow, so I hope it's not too noisy, it's a bit clubby around this area. 6.07, right outside the uh, lift. <laughs> Shit, it's gonna work, no. Bloody hell, that's not very good. Oh. A few moments later. Oh. Bosh, here we go then guys, check out the room. I'll show you the bar from in a minute. Okay, well that's not bad is it? Here's all the the mini bar down here. <laughs> Just got bottles of wine and beer in it. <laughs> check it out, there's uh, the, the mirror with the handsome guy. Got the wardrobes, the wardrobe, it's not a bad size wardrobe. There you go, Let's zoom away. It's a flat screen TV, oh nice. Tables, oh table, the chair, sofa. The bed over there, the single bed there, that's not bad. That's not bad at all, is it? Pretty nice room, actually. I say it's a pretty brand new hotel. You say everything's sort of like really clean and nicely done. I say it's a nice double bed. It's a. Uh... Oh dear. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's not, the, not the nicest of beds, unfortunately. Yeah. I think uh, Mum's going to have to uh, ask for a topper or something. Um, cool. Let's have a butchers at the bathroom. Oh wow, look at that, that's nice isn't it? Yeah, that's nice. Got the glass bit here, the shower. Got the shower gels in there and everything, the boom door. That's a nice mirror, check out the size of that. Whoa! I think bloody hell, I need to lose weight. Uh, yeah, there you go then, guys, that is the room. Pretty nice. Um, we're just going to get settled in then and get something to eat and I'll catch up with you in a bit. Check, well, check it out guys, so we've just left our hotel now after getting settled in for a little bit and uh, she had to do a little bit of work and now we're just heading off down to the beach to find uh, something to eat. <laughs> sort of rhymes, rhymes a bit. Yeah, getting a little bit peckish now, I just started the day off with uh, a couple of teas and uh, some hard boiled eggs for a perfect keto breakfast, there you go, keto snacky breakfast anyway. And uh, obviously I had some like, mushroom and some creatine and whatnot as well, and taurine and uh, that, so get that in, very healthy for you. And like I say, we're just heading off down to the beach now and uh, yeah, see if we can find any food. Not sure if we're going to do like a local restaurant or scissor or something. Anyway, see you in a sec. A few, uh, few minutes later, we've got to the beach road, Padia Beach Road. It's relatively busy, not as busy as I thought it was going to be. At least we got a bit of, uh, at least we got a bit of sun now. Like I say I peed it down earlier on. Now we're just uh, heading off, I think, probably to Royal Garden Plaza, the famous shopping mall here. Not that famous, but yeah, it's a shopping mall, and it's here. <laughs> I'm probably going to get a scissors. I think we decided, unless we see anything else on the way. Oh wow, check out that. And oh yeah, by the way, Patia is uh, the sea. Of friggin' boats, I tell you, there's more friggin' boats than there is bloody water. Check it out, it's absolutely mental. This place is absolutely crazy. I don't know how you uh, how you navigate over it. Look at it all. <laughs> how many friggin' boats are there? This is absolutely mental. It's ridiculous or what? I can't really see it at the moment. The sun's well bright. Right, there you go. Patia, the beach of boats, sea of boats. <laughs> tell you what, this is bloody annoying. Not one in the way, I mean. Uh, they're doing all the bloody floor again at Patia Beach. So there was nothing wrong with it like about 10 months ago. So yeah, ripped it all up, putting these massive uh, curbs in and then raising it up for some reason. They got a thing lately in Thailand about raising up the, the pavement like a metre high and then putting it on terrible foundation. Hopefully it's done soon. Yeah, check it out, I've just got to... Uh... Oh God, floating in my eye. So we've got to sizzler now, I've just got our food. Check it out, I'll tell you what, absolutely freaking kit service in this branch. The manager is an absolute bloody a-hole, useless pile of rubbish. Unbelievable, I can't believe it. And they've run out all the freaking eggs and everything, so a bit peed off really. Oh, so the staff are absolutely terrible. One like this last time. Oh my god, I've got lotion in my Anyway, I'm just going to show you what I eat before I start crying on camera. Oh, lotion. 
So I've got some Caesar salad with some bacos and some what they call sunflower seeds. This one's a blue cheese sauce with some parmesan and some broccoli and um, what's it called? The doodah. What is it called? What do you call that one? Beetroot, beetroot. This one I've got the, the salad with like a chicken and um, cranberry and there's like a mixture of different stuff on that one as well. The load of cheese. And this is what mother's got. Oh, I didn't see that cheese. Where's that one? Was it on the actual island? I didn't mm. see it. Oh, really? I must have, I can't believe I missed that. And uh, this is what she's got. Like, the, the different bits down there. Corn, the tomato, da 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 da. And some sweet corn soup. And yeah, oh, soda refill. It's not sweet corn, no? It's not sweet corn. What is it? It looks like sweet corn. Shit, oh, it's cheese in there. <laughs> cheese and something soup. Tuna and mushroom mixed together. Tuna and mushroom mixed together. Sounds good, sounds good. There we go then. And check it out. I've calmed down a little bit now after my annoyance from the useless uh, manager here. I've got another plate of food. I've got some raisins, obviously not very keto, and a few sunflower seeds again, some coleslaw, and a salad underneath there with a bit of parmesan and blue cheese sauce. So I had to get a few more sort of seeds and a bit of cheese. Seeds and cheese, oh yeah, perfectly fine, okay, keto. And a little bit of that there, some cranberries and whatnot in that little bit of salad. And obviously a fruit, some fruit. I've got some guava, some cantaloupe, and some pineapple. Obviously none of that fruit is really keto at all. But uh, it doesn't mean it's not healthy, it just means it's not keto. There you go. Well, I figured out guys, so I just finished eating his scissors and that. Not too bad towards the end. The other guy was uh, very apologetic and that, and it was really friendly, so that's all good. All good. I couldn't really stuff the at all getting up and walking around a bit. Anyway, in this small uh, Sizzlers in um, Royal Garden Plaza, they got Ripley's, believe it or not. Believe it or not, it's still open. It's absolutely dead. You can see there's no one here. It's busier than this when it was in freaking COVID time. So you can check that video out if you want after this one. But uh, yeah, well quiet, well quiet. Yeah, I'm glad it's still open, but um, yeah. I don't think they'd be making that much money here, really. Yeah, check it out, Madame Two Swords. You know, the face is all right, but those eyes, look at those eyes, they're creepy as hell, look. Do they look, uh, they look pretty real, don't they? <laughs> it's like something like the, the remake of the House of Wax. It's like a ru rubbishy face, and like, you can see the eyes, like, ah! <laughs> there you go, check it out, guys, the wax works. You can see this evil biatch, Mother Teresa, one of the scummiest people on the planet. Check it out guys, believe it or not, Robert Wadlow, the tallest bloke ever to live that we know of. Here you go, look, he's 199 kilograms and he was 8 foot 11 inches, 2.72 meters, crazy. And that's her next to him. <laughs> that's crazy, that's crazy. Wow. There we go, check it out. Look how tall he is. This is mental. This is me, yeah, reaching high. I'm freaking six foot, um, yeah, six foot two, 188 centimeters. Alright. <laughs> Mental. Can you believe? Can you imagine being that big? Absolutely crazy. Oh, check out the haunted dolls. <laughs> there you go. This, bit, this section's pretty new. Oh, wow, the water's pretty cool. Check out the Thai guy in a wheelchair. That's scary. Whoa. <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's not a real daughter behind. There you go, check him out. That's pretty scary. <laughs> yeah, horror hospital. <laughs> yeah. The guy in the wheelchair, the doctor bloke, just jumped right out of the wheelchair and freaking scared the shit out of him. Absolutely hilarious. Oh, I think I wish I caught that out of the That's so funny. So funny. Oh, check out this though, this bit does look a bit scary. There you go, sure, check out this guy, it's awesome or what? Your discretion is advised. Wow, there's a dead body with all the intestines coming out. <laughs> Somebody's leg. <laughs> oh my God, there's like a, I think it's probably supposed to be a doll, but there you go, half of his body here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Wicked, look at that. Awesome. We got another we got another new one here. Looks like the Toxic Avenger. Da, da, da. That's wicked. Look at that. How cool is that? There's a skeleton skull heads in there. That's just wicked. That's cool as hell. That's like mutate with a giant eyeball and everything. <laughs> How cool is that? 
So yeah, this is like in the, the, the what's it called, the shopping mall. So uh, if you're a bit scared, don't come on the top floor. <laughs> That's wicked, isn't it? Check it out. She looks quite nice, doesn't she? Ooh, yeah. Ooh, sexy. <laughs> Take a look. Do an easy. Scary. <laughs> ah. Huh? She said, me, me and Daddy are a bit going up to get some. <laughs> well, that's cool, look at that. Yeah. Oh, look at the doll, that's pretty scary, isn't it? <laughs> nightmares or what? That'll definitely give you nightmares. <laughs> ah, there's our uh, bumblebee thing of a bob robot. Oh, that didn't they have to? I've moved it around. Penny farthing, awesome. Is the uh, mammoth? Look at the size of that. These things are crazy awesome. I love to see them come back. What do you think, guys? Should mammoths come back? Should we bring them back? It's amazing the size of mammoths, isn't it? Look at it. Wicked. We can bring them back with like DNA. That's really awesome. Because uh, they're not that long extinct. I think we could bring them back. Personally, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Whoa, thank you very much. It's Elvis, not a horror film, woman. <laughs> oh, the Ripley's area and everything. You can uh, check it out all for free at the top section of uh, Royal Garden Plaza Mall, so definitely check that out. It's worth a, a visit, and obviously, if you want to do the rides and everything, it's going to cost a bit more. I think you can do all eight of the things here for about 3,000 baht, which is a little bit pricey, but um, if you're a tourist or whatnot, maybe it's not that much for you, I don't know. But yeah, as you know, uh, I'm, I'm a, a tight hobo, so <laughs> everything overlapping in under parts is crazy for me. Anyway, there you go, then, guys. So, after uh, having our sisters and then pictures around Royal Garden Plaza, checking out all the scary haunted hospital, and Ripley, believe it or not, floor, we uh, headed back to the hotel. Uh, we dropped Mama off at the hotel and then we just uh, headed off for a massage. She really fancied a massage, so they got some really cheap ones okay. along to a poor pal, which is uh, freaking amazing. Like, uh, oh, they're so cheap, like a hundred bar. Like, you can get like a, um, yeah, so a massage for like two pounds fifty, three, four pounds. Yeah. Really cheap. There you go in front. Which is obviously, as you know, being a tight hobo, that's freaking awesome for me. <laughs> Anyway, so I say here's uh, the Soy Boy and Powers are walking down now, a bit of a party road, lots of bars and loads of places to eat. They've got a couple of sort of like English y sort of uh, restaurant y places down, English food shops, which is awesome. Get your tea bags, English food, baked beans. <laughs> So yeah, we're just walking down there, but unfortunately when we get to like the massages, they're absolutely fully booked, absolutely even with people. So yeah, we we'll just headed off like, back to the hotel oh, afterwards. But I say this is nice to have a good walk because it's really good to like, uh, I say, have a walk after eating a lot of carbohydrates, get your glucose mobilised. If you care about that sort of stuff, it's a bit So yeah, there we go, guys. That was our uh, Patty of Day One. Stay tuned for Patty of Day Two, and uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Cool. Check out that app now. Fucking comments. Here, the sound of death and in fear. Oh.